Hello viewers, in this uh, we have amazing Strider Enterprises Company Commercial. It's one of the software that helps you to do one of the sliders that you see in different websites, uh, either for schools, for companies, for those corporate businesses, different businesses, for the bloggers, among others. In this case, you can use this software to create a slider and this one is uh, is good for advertisement and because most of the website people you need to refer and see some of the information in the website uh, that means once they see for the photos they can know how what you are dealing with or those photos can tell some of the things that you deal with in that before they go on and read more about the website it means in this case you can create another web software then you export them to now to the main software that they are using. Let me show you how to do work work on this. In this case, you need to go to file menu here. But because as you can see the language here, it's may it is using a different language. For example, it is using a French. Now maybe you don't understand the French. So what are you going to do? You can change the language here. We have variety of language from French, we have the Italian. You can see how the Italian look like. We have the the Japanese there. You can see a kind of a Chinese there, and you have different from Spanish. That is how you can see it's written in Spanish. And now you can change the Spanish to English. Once you change the English, now most of the people they understand English. So it means first you change the language from the United. It is English that is um, the U.S. English here. And now once you change this thing to, to English, now you can see we have the file, we have the design, we have the language, and you have the help. Uh, we have five steps to make an amazing slider. Five steps to make an amazing slider. In this case, we are told first add images and videos to the slider. So it means you can put images and videos at the same time in your slider. But for this time, I need to show you how you can put for example that images uh, later you can work on how you can put different videos you can combine them and become part of your side but sometimes they make it take too long time to uh, throw that's why we do use photos in most cases uh, then you have a uh, select a skin and customize it uh, then choose your favorite transition effects Configure the side options, publish to HTML files. That means those are the five main steps that you can gonna use for that one. Let's work with first here. You can have a new project. You can come with this new project here. And now with this new project here, uh, which is now still you can see this new project, it is untitled. So we have this one to open a project which is existing. And now we have how to save the project in this case. It means because I have new now, I can just come here, I can save the project so that I can give it a name. Uh, in this case, I need to go to desktop. Uh, we have uh, that folder called banners. And come here, I create a folder here, and I save my. Uh, website my folder has the uh, tutorials you have tutorials uh, downloads uh, for you have such a Kenya so once you save like that one now with that folder there you can come here you click open that folder once you click that open folder then you can come here give us uh, tutorials uh, banners uh, downloads for advertisements then you can now click save at that as you can see once you save this name will be reflected here tutorials banners downloads for advertisement dot i am a strider which is now amazing strider uh, once you save that one now uh, you can come here you click the side 
Let's click the slide. You choose now the width of the slide and the height of the slide. So here you can see the option we have do not crop images and do not crop uh, thumbnails. In this case, there are some photos that, for example, they are very bigger in size, so it means unless you crop them a little bit, it means most of the photos will be visible and some of them will not be visible in full. So here you have to, you are told to give this option in case you want to do not crop images or do not crop thumbnails you can replace that we have do not stretch images in this case but for for me i can choose to stretch images where those photos are not visible but let me first you see the when it's being stretched and why not they are not stretched then you have the image fill color which is now transparent or solid solid here when you see this color whereby this color if uh, it represent f uh, 6f represent white color while you put for example 1 2 3 4 5 6 that represent a black color which will be now the fill color for that to be a black if you need to add another color you can have the same you can use the different codings and now have we call them hexacodes colors whereby you can use them to combine for example you can put ef 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 or you can put six six three three and you have nine nine those still represent a color or that one you can put for example ff that can still represent a certain color for that where again whereby you're gonna see it when once you put then you can change to a different one let's see now the reason you have the where you can now get your source of your images here we have you can add videos either on youtube we have email and you can still move where you want and you can still arrange them move up and down as you choose more option here for either sorting or sending or descending uh, either by title or by file name among others and how you can still move this one as uh, this you can see you can rotate right and you can rotate uh, left for this let me choose add images for this one and once i choose add images i need to go to the, my folder here which is now balance 2 uh, once i have that one now i can come here i select all my photos if i'm interested in them i can just come here i hold shift then i select all of them there and i click open automatically you can see all my photos there with their titles and in case i need to put uh, we have the button text you can just come here and you can put your own link here so that will reflect that uh, the button text here whereby you can have some kind of a button text here for example uh, we have this one as uh, uchumi uh, uchumi logo for that one uh, we have the button link where you can put www.sachemkenya.com uh, stroke advertisement advertisement and dot html for example that one uh, then here you can describe more about uh, how to draw Uchumi logo using uh, MS Paint tutorial. You can describe something like that. Uh, and then we have choose special text effect. In this case, we have uh, maybe a certain text effect from the from the. We have this one for this one. As you can see here, uh, we have this one for. For the for the bottom uh, bar we have the bottom left among other options here we have uh, navy box we have pink box you can put in case you need to have that one and we have some more options still you can choose for that one but you can take you know some of them there and move on with another section here 
either you put as for the other one there and now you can come here and have a little bit there and you can click ok you can see here we have applied the option to all sides but in my case I need to apply it for that one first then I say ok I'll go back to this one and now you can see how it's been processing uh, as for this one you can see how it's been processing the thumbnails the photo there are 27 of them and now you can see how it look like as how my advert look like you can see the colors i put in there and now my advertisement that you can see is very amazing as you can see it's looking nice uh, that's some of the things that you can work on that one uh, as you can see it's been an advertisement and how it's loading uh, for this one i have to go to the last one there so they can change uh, now we have something called skin in this skin now you can see this this is the richest uh, skin I have chosen there we have that one for example that is the one which is called classic we have this one called uh, content we have content box we have the cube and now we have the desktop for example that one I can click uh, apply once I click apply I can click ok now see how it look like that one and then look like a, a screen whereby you can see how it is re reflecting there uh, I can still come here I try to scrub it and see the screen itself there you can see the entire screen there you can see how reflect all about that you can either come here and see now the content there as for that content there which is one you point there you can see some of the content which is uh, referred there as for that advertisement uh, you can still go back to the skin and I choose a different one so that you can see a different variety of them whereby once you choose that one and you click ok you can see now the content of the advertisement on that website how to be representing that you can be knowing which will be now going to come later after the first one is being displayed it's how it's being displayed there you can see a different one and how it is moving from now the other one and you can see scroll you can see once you scroll you can see the rest there which is now by scrolling them you can see the rest there let's see another one still here you can see the moment you point there there are some content which is coming here at the bottom of the page uh, in this case you can see the skin here there are many of them there you can see a different one for example that one is two and that one reflect at the bottom of the page there this one you can see now they reflect at the bottom of the page so that you can see how it is moving from one to another on its own and now it have given a couple of some seconds there whereby you can still adjust those seconds so that you can go either faster or go a bit slower towards that transitions uh, now with that one as you move now let's see more skin uh, we have now different skin there so that you can see now that kind of a skin reflect the content at the same time it means you can see now the content of that one for example complete access you can see it develop software it is changing and it's give, giving me some a small title there of the content there are no free, free tutorials among others you can see it is giving some of the tutorials on that uh, as for this one now I can go back to the side one here and I choose for example this is the size of my screen 900 by 360 in this case it means for example do not stretch I move that one and I click OK let's see how that will work do not stretch As you can see do not stretch you can see how the content look like 
but it's not filled as for that they have most option there you can come here do not crop images then you click ok once you remove that one and you see when you choose do not crop images you will select how it will happen let's wait and see how it will happen once you see as you can see do not crop images now it is full screen but the charge some crucial content information has been cropped as is there another charge that you should make sure you work on because most crucial if you not uh, be seen it means it won't be uh, smart once some of the content cannot be seen that's why you need to come here to prove that one then you have not crop the thumbnails uh, in this case for example you remove that one there and now click ok and see how it look like when it is look like it is like that that's how it look like for that one once you see do not crop for that one uh, now you can see the, this one do not crop images there uh, we have said that once you see that do not crop images you see how it look like in this case but for me you can say that do not stretch images this one uh, then you can click ok see there uh, something else you can consider most of the photos as you can see here it is not full in size as per what is most of the photos designed that tells you you can still come here you adjust this width because the height may be okay but <coughs> this comes the width you can count here that try to adjust to be 600 for example you can light 600 there and now you click ok let's see how once you reduce that one to 600 by 360 and see how you affect that slider for that now you can see it's already fit well almost now to the desired size we just a small margin whereby you can see it's only in the height but in most cases it's already almost in full almost in full in this one let me change the skin to your different skin so that you can see how you can be affected in different uh, skin because you have a variety of skin there you have them there you can come here you have that one for the wood rod. you have this one for that you have that one there among more others there just choose that one for example i need that one the stylish we have the simplicity there uh, we have that one there where well, can you come and choose those that you are decided with for example that one and say okay and you see now how to reflect i can still come here to the skin to be a different uh, skin let me choose the one I was choosing there for example this uh, this for the screen there but you can see that one is overwriting there let me choose a variety one which I see is the one we will reflect uh, the my content without any contradiction let me choose that one for example the stylish there and say okay I choose there you can see now the variety of photos there but in this and the content we are there you can see how they are changing for themselves from number one automatically you go to number two three and number four respectively it is rolling on self after that Still, we have varieties 
we have that one uh, more features like that one let's say okay you can see now it's loading itself without a problem with now a different color in that case once we make that one as your desired size uh, for that one now with a different size now you can come to this one called transitions as we choose the transition here you can have these transitions uh, you can come here you choose the transition that you want here you can put just a different one you can have your probe and put as many as possible and in case you have this one there's about the division miles you have about is for that one for example changing from that one to a different this one and you click ok uh, if you need to change this one for example there you come to change this one from is out from different to that one let you see ok uh, size directions is 3 which is ok you can adjust maybe to be five there and now we have more option for the 3d whereby you can come and choose maybe for example where we want to change that one 3d to this and let's say okay let's how we change all those transitions from another one to a different one once you are through just everything should be automatic is how you should work on that one and now you click ok once you click ok now uh, now you can see now the different uh, designs now they are how they are working on themselves without no problem or no contradiction that you can see it is working without no problem uh, then we have now this one you can come here you take more option for this that means as you can see here we have to make uh, create a responsive slider where by that one depend with the device that you are using while you're using the desktop to become bigger in size while using in the in the mobile phone becomes smaller kid full wind slider but that one is not good for the screen in this case just take that one for responsive there do not resize the images in this case uh, you can come here do not resize the images all else this one can still have be like that and then you click a uh, loop file forever uh, start from the specified loop you can just put like that one and you have auto play videos in case you have a video you can just keep here you have to play the video you have the post on mouse over whereby you can just come you put there you have loading images on demand uh, and now we have add watermark in this add watermark you can just click there and you move this uh, we have the text and you have the images in my case here you can come here I put now the website uh, as as that one you can just come here I put now the website once you put the website here you reflect now the watermark of your slider whereby automatically you will be, be in a position to give a link you can just come you put there and you put now the content of that one to be your watermark it means if the software is not genuine it means automatically to add an automatic watermark for amazing cider whereby to be their own link but for this one it means uh, you have to know how to remove the watermark and add your own logos it means it is all about buying a new software and get that one as well to activate this one and now once you are through with that you just click ok once I click ok there we have now the we have this one I have uh, dealt with with that content there and now you can click OK once you click OK and you can come here we have the issue of uh, publish and now you can came 
and click preview so that you can see how it's all about in the internet before now when you are in a website you can now see how to be in terms of the size and in case you want to add the size you can know how you can still add the size to give the reflect of that slider how it is working you can see now you have the link where but it's not changing that one for the website now you can see the moment you point there it will go to date to your website uh, as you can see there how it's been advertised in a very easier way without no problem you can see it is very nice and very presentable in this That's how you work on that one. Now you can see it's very okay. Now you want to do with everything now because for me I'm now through. What I need to do is now to publish uh, to web 
page so to do this uh, publishing to our web page just click publish and once you click publish uh, we have now the, uh, the, the the folder name here by the way we need to save to a folder there we have the cider file name in my case I need to put my um, cider as, uh, as this one I can just put Sachem Kenya uh, Sachem Kenya cider dot uh, HTML we have to save the image folder here yeah. you can click and save to images there and we have this one you can still remain like that one add absolute URL in case you want to put an asset, a certain absolute URL you can just come here and you can now click on uh, publish to as word plus plugin or complete for uh, publish to a Joomla to Joomla module or publish to Drupal module one of them you can just come here with your brief publish to that one but for me I need to publish to I need to publish offline so that once I publish to offline Anytime to a different website, I can want to put, I can just put that one in a different website without no problem or fear of contradiction. I just come click publish, browse. I choose now where I need to reflect my work. I have that folder there. I'll come here, I choose this folder there. Then I click select. I click select there now I can come here I click publish you can see now it's publishing and I finally have completed my work that is how you create a slider uh, in the website in a very simple steps and you end up completing your work without no fear of contradiction now your website is done for that slider whereby now you can go and put in your website wherever you want in different types of software even if you have created your website in Joomla or you have created in Drupal or any other software or in any which software you are using now you can be a position to go and put in a source those main coding there and those coding as you can see here in this as I call there I got my folder there and I come to this folder here I can see now we have this one for this advertisement here and now we have this such as Kenya Cider and you have the images there and we have the Cider engine there which is now the main file for, for that what you need to do is just come here you right click here and end up you zip your file here you can just complete to zip and now so as you complete to zip that one there and you do this the next to this one and now you can upload your files uh, once you upload those two files there this file in this one then you can go and extract in your main domain those are the two main files you need to do and those don't have those files uh, that's comes comes down to the now you can see how it's been advertised on its own without no issue of problem and now you can see simple and clear way of advertisement and creating a banner in your software with its own with your own uh, admin uh, logo that means you are putting your own watermark there as you can see here we have the watermark there which remain the main identity for that without no problem now you can see how it's been advertised once you put them out there it pulls automatically and now you remove you can see just put to stand once you put there it's not moving just move out the mouse now you can see the advertise is now moving on sound without one problem different designs there you can now enjoy until all photos are done and automatically will repeat or loop until you stop with my by mouse but automatically when you run the website you'll be indicating what everything you do about those some of those tutorials there 
you can see how they are being advertised without no problem or fear of contradiction using a software amazing slider just subscribe and learn more about how you can make those ones and gather some of those advertised there those are some of our tutorials you can search them in the tutorial kenya our twitter handle facebook search in kenya and our instagram you can still see the tutorial uh, the tutorials underscore kenya and get those tutorials for us don't forget to subscribe on youtube and get more update on the latest video uh, the latest tutorials that you are putting in our in a link on youtube thank you and subscribe don't forget keep subscribing and subscribe for more anytime just continue subscribing anytime you see this icon it's all about free downloads in our tutorials enjoy our tutorials as we move up to the end you can see there is very smart for advertisement from one to another you can keep adding them there and you can see some of those tutorials there well advertised about such a infotech leader in information technology center for ICT courses there is our location for um, for our colleges and you can learn more and you can come here and join us and learn some of those courses as you can see there are courses offered there those are just some among others programs that you do uh, teach there in our courage such a courage and learn more more and more knowledge about the different softwares